How did this happen? First I lose all my money in a Ponzi scheme. Then I lose my job. All the same day. On Christmas Eve. <laughs> now how am I going to buy last minute gifts for my friends and family from the gas station? I'm the worst son slash brother slash friend ever. <laughs> Hello? Well, sure, I'll be right over. Nathan, you old dog, you come on in. Thanks for inviting me over, pal. I feel pretty blue. Yeah. Hey man, no problem. Things must be pretty tough for you right now. What with your losing all your money and your job. The next thing you know, it'll be your friends and family too. What with you not being able to afford Christmas presents and all. What? How did you know all that? That literally just happened. I haven't even told anyone. You're right. I am an awesome person. And a great friend. That's not what I said. No need to thank me. At least not until I've shown you how I'm going to get you out of your Christmas conundrum. Follow me, pal. This is the cure to all your problems. The solution to your troubles. The snake oil for your dysentery. The Giftatron 5000. Say uh, the internet. Wow. Come on, let me show you how it works. Stand over there if you would. Oh, okay. Just close your eyes, think real hard about what you want it to make, and poof, it shall magically appear. Can I do it again? Of course! <laughs> Ashton, this is so incredible. How could I ever thank you? I wonder who that could be. I'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> 
kind sir. Thank you so much. What are you? Me? I'm just a lowly Christmas elf, sir. A Christmas elf? How'd you get here? Well, sir, two weeks ago I was hard at work in the candy cane mines when I was suddenly kidnapped. Ever since then, I've been trapped in this box, forced to make toys and trinkets for whoever possesses it. Oh, that's so terrible! Yes, sir, but really, I just miss my family. We always spend Christmas together, since it's our only day off all year. But I guess that's not gonna happen. Oh, that's so much more terrible! <laughs> Just a bunch of lousy kids trying to get me to donate to charity, but I set them straight. <laughs> what the? Uh, what the? Uh, what, what, what's going on here? All right, Ashton, I've had enough of your lies. I know you did this, poor little elf guy. I'm stopping it. Set him free. What about all the presents? Without presents, Christmas is meaningless, right? The presents don't matter, Ashton. Not anymore. Oh, now I know how foolish I've been. Christmas isn't about presents. It's about spending time with the ones you love, your family, your friends. It doesn't matter if you buy them something expensive or you make them something for free. All that matters is that you show them that you love them. Is your family and friends more valuable than any gift could ever be? <laughs> What's so funny? Nathan, you magnificent bastard! This was my plan all along! <gasps> you see, it was I who set up the Ponzi scheme to which you lost all of your money. So you're the CEO of Flash and Kransas Industries? And it was I who alerted your manager to your lascivious behavior with the probiotic yogurt. Yeah, I did do that one. I probably deserved it. All of this so that you would find yourself in a situation of financial ruin and emotional desperation so harsh that my too good to be true Giftotron 5000 couldn't not pique your interest. Once you arrived, I demonstrated the device and captured your imagination, then proceeded to fake a doorbell ring using the most cutting-edge ventriloquism techniques this side of the Baltic Sea. <laughs> Knowing that once I'd left the room, your insatiable curiosity would inevitably lead you to peer inside and encounter Mr. Alfred Hitchcock here. <laughs> His penchant for whining about his family, coupled with your sensitivity toward kidnapping victims, has brought us to the here and now, where you've learned a valuable lesson about the true meaning of Christmas. You're welcome. Wow, that's really detailed and specific. <sighs> I can't believe you and the elf planned this whole thing. Huh? Uh, no, no, he's my slave. Oh. I miss my family. Get back in your box! <laughs> Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a happy